carbs, can't the fuck up motherfuckers Carb the fuck up corn, rice, potatoes, yams, bananas, mangoes, dates, plantain, melons, blueberries, blackberries, moles Get them motherfucking carbohydrates in Go vegan motherfuckers, can't the fuck up the fuck up the fuck up Got a question here about vasectomies, uh, children, sexual performance. Does the vasectomy affect your sexual performance? Uh, we had a guy here who said he thought the vasectomy, you cut your dong open and your dick doesn't work no more. Uh, I'll tell you what, I've had a vasectomy, your dick works fine. Just ask your mum. But seriously though, it doesn't affect your sexual performance. It increases it because you have less fucking stress. And if you're a guy and you got stress, you go from... Limp as a fucking wet noodle, mate. So, if you can relax more, and you have to worry about getting your missus pregnant, boom! You're going to be harder, a lot harder, relative than you would otherwise. This is just fucking fact, bro. If you've got more stress, you can't get as hard as if you could otherwise, relative to your individual potential there. So this guy, he goes, okay, so now he's cleared up about vasectomies. All I do is you snip your Van Deferens, which is like a little iPhone charging cord. Yeah, it's just like a little cord. Where's the cord? <laughs> You know, it's just like a little cord. You got two cords on your nuts, and it's just like push them back in, ready to go, bro. You know, give a sample. As long as you've got no swimmers, bust your nuts and your missus balls deep. But you got to get the clearance first, right? Don't give a second and start getting at it. You've got to get your clearance first. Got to give a sample. Give a sample, and uh, that's what that's what it is. It doesn't. You don't fucking lose your nuts. You don't lose your dick. Your dick doesn't get sliced open, right? A lot of guys aren't educated out there, and that's that's. That's the society's plan. Don't educate men about vasectomies. Just pump women full of steroids, exogenous sex steroids, like the pill, etc. Anyway, let's get to the question. Uh, this, this young man was saying, I'm saying disabling your reproductive system is unnatural. It's unnatural, so don't do it. Well, why the fuck are you talking to me on a mobile phone on Instagram if, that's, if unnatural means we shouldn't do it? Don't do it because it's unnatural. That's hypocritical, bro. You can't just go, like, select. You know what I mean? Like, shitting on the street in public would be natural, but we don't do it because it's just, like, weird, man. So not getting vasectomy because it's not natural, but then communicating with another human being on the internet, which is not natural, is okay. That's hypocritical, bro. Anyway, everyone everyone is a hypocrite at some point, even myself. And he goes on to say, It's true there are countries in the world less fortunate than our own, but children are not dying in the United States nor Australia due to starvation. So I don't know why that has anything to do with people in our countries reproducing. You've got great DNA, man. And it would be an absolute shame to see you in your color. I hear where you're coming from, bro. But the fact that I've got good DNA doesn't mean shit. Because I don't know, a shit ton of drugs. And that kid could have fucking 10 heads and fucking ADD like me. So doesn't mean shit, man, about your genetics. Because that's just a fucking roll of the dice. And as, as saying that... um. Because Australia and the US is, we don't have no starvation it means it's fine to breed. It's like, no, no, no. I don't believe in countries, man. This is my personal opinion. And I'm not talking this individual. I'm talking to everyone here right now. I don't believe in countries personally. I believe in one motherfucking planet. Because if we drop a fucking atom bomb in a certain part of the world, that drift's going over. All right? You can't just... This is a fucking big thing of like, well, this is my country, all right? So the world's good. No, man, the world is the world. There's no such thing as a country in my mind, man. We're on this planet together. One motherfucking planet. It's a fucking circle. We've got any circles around here. It's a ball. No, oranges. You know what I mean? Just because you live on one side of the ball doesn't mean you're off the ball. You can't throw something away. There is no way. You can't flush pollution away. There is no way. It's still here. It's in the atmosphere. It's in the soil. It's getting spread around. The ocean currency, air... Look at all that radioactive shit going on, man. It's getting spread around, bro. There's DDT in the fucking polar bear's urine in Antarctica and shit. So anyone who thinks, that, oh, my country's fine, bro, it's great, is fucking sadly disillusioned. Delusional. Not disillusioned, but delusional. I'm disillusioned. I see so much fucking truth. I've traveled the world more than 99.9% of people ever will. So I understand that my viewpoints in the world are really fucking unique compared to the mainstream Kentucky tour, beer swilling, Super Bowl cheering, Tupperware fucking microwaving, McDonald's fast food to take away fucking picking up person, you know? Drink some beers, do 21, let's get shit faced, yay! That sort of mentality. Been there, done that. So I understand why I do sound like a crazy motherfucker, but seriously, man. 
get a vasectomy. You know, if you got kids, get a vasectomy. If you don't want kids, get a vasectomy. If you want kids, get a vasectomy and adopt. Or help out your friends or your brother or sister who's got kids. Pretty much everyone's got someone to know that's got kids and is fucking just doing it hard financially, physically. Even my friends who are fucking loaded men. You're living in Asia, Europe, Australia, fucking US. I've got a lot of friends out there, man. So have a lot of people. A lot of people struggle, man, just to keep it fucking together. Mentally, physically, financially, spiritually, everything. Because they've got kids, it's fucking tough, man. So just think about giving your time. If you want if you love kids that much, man, don't create more. All right? If you already got them, you can't do anything. You can't send them out to warranty, like I always say. If you love kids that much, do something today. If you love kids that much, do something today for the kids who have nobody to fucking give them food or water or shelter. If you fucking love kids so much, walk your fucking talk and do something about it today. All right? Don't create more kids, man. If you love them that much. I love kids. I want to have my own. Do you want to have your own or do you want to help children? A big fucking difference there. Think about it. Do you want to create more problems or do you want to help the problems that are already here? Well, it's not my own. It's not my problem. It is your problem. It's one fucking planet. Think about it. Get a vasectomy, motherfucker. Go get, get them vasectomy gains, motherfucker. Stress-free. Save money. Better for the plant. Better for the kid. Kids. Get a vasectomy, motherfucker. And bust it balls, balls deep into the lady, lady, lady.